Hello, in the video coming up, I'll show you how you can get rid of the quick links in the new Chrome OS app launcher menu. A couple of months ago, I showed you how you could use the new Chrome OS app launcher menu using a Chrome OS flag, and I'm sure if you've tried it, you will absolutely love it because it's much better than the original or the current default menu it's still the case that you would need to use the flag to get the menu and the new menu if you're not if you haven't seen it is this one here so instead of it going across all of the display like that it's here one thing is obviously because it's a flag they will always change slightly because they work on them until they get to a point where they're going to have them on the stable channel without needing a flag so you should expect anything where you have installed a flag that it may change from time to time. One thing you may have noticed is that we've been getting quick links up here and I haven't got it on here I'll show you what it looks like. And if you've got these and you want to get rid of them, I'll show you how you can get rid of them. They look like this here. And the intention is, so when you go on the start menu, instead of just having your menu like that, like I've got here, you've also got these links here. Now the reason for these is so you can get quick access to files you've just worked on, which may be great and you might absolutely love that. But personally speaking, I don't like the look of it, look, look. I don't like the way the icons are a bit, and the, it's just a bit messy, and I, I would prefer not to have it there. So it, 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 it's a bit frustrating that it was, it's, sometimes it's there and sometimes it's not, and at the moment on the current stable channel, it, it, they are there. Um, so I wanted to see if you could remove them, and the strange thing is there is now an option to do it, and the good news is that you can actually do it via the flag, which is really strange. I've not used flags lots, but I have used them quite a bit in the last few months. And one thing I've only ever really noticed is you either have default, enabled or disabled. But I've noticed with this flag now, there's an extra option. And that extra option allows you to get rid of those quick links if you want to, like I have here. Now the good news is for that, as for, I don't know for a fact, but what I'm hoping is what that means is if they've done that with the flag, they put the effort into allowing you to either add the quick links showing or not, then hopefully when it is actually put onto the stable channel as standard, that new menu, maybe we'll have the option to choose whether we want them quick links or we don't want them quick links. And I think that would be the best option because although I love Chrome OS, the one thing about Chrome OS is that it's it's possibly the least customizable operating system you've used but the good re good good reason for that is that it is very lightweight it's fast and secure and it's easy to use all of that's great however everybody would like to customize their chromebook to an extent so what i'm hoping is the fact that they've changed this flag means that when it does come onto the stable channel as standard that new menu that you'll have the option whether you want them quick links or you don't and i can't imagine that being that difficult for them to keep on the, on the stable chrome os operator system so i really do hope that's something they do so if you do have those quick links like these ones here and you want to get rid of them or if you haven't even got this menu and you want to get it, I'll, I'll show you now how you do it. So just open up your Chrome browser and then go to Chrome. So it's C-H-R-O-M-E colon forward slash forward slash or it's backwards slash backwards slash um, and then flags, hit return. And then if I maximize that, you'll see here it's this one here, Productivity Experience App Launcher. There's now a, an extra option, which is really strange. I've never seen that with a flag before. And at first I didn't know what it meant. It just says enabled where it continue. And I'm like, what does that mean? So I had to obviously look into it. Um, and what it means is if you, in, if you just select enabled, you will have those quick links. However, if you don't, and you'll have the menu. So if you haven't got that menu, this is how you get that menu. But if you have got the menu and you've got the quick links and you want to get rid of those quick links, just change it to enabled without continue, which is, as you can see, is what I've got currently on. And what that does then is it removes the quick links from the menu, which I personally, like I said, some people might really like the idea of having the quick links because they are possibly good for productivity, 
but for me I'd rather not have it so uh, that's how you do it I hope this video has helped if it has please like because I will try and keep on top of things that I can see change on Chrome OS and if I think they're important I will put, make a video about them so please like and subscribe to the channel for future videos and thanks for watching